Hi, I'm Jenny Stallard. I'm a lifestyle journalist and I'm the founder of Freelance Leals, a wellbeing platform for freelancers which includes a podcast and newsletter. I write for women's magazines and websites as well as national newspapers and I have recently been in-house on a health team writing print and web features. I got into self-employment in a slightly unusual way. This is the third time that I've been freelance. Um, I've often been lured back into staff jobs. I went freelance in April 2017 after redundancy from a job on a national newspaper and I decided to become self-employed and stick to being self-employed because I knew that it was the life for me. But no two days are the same and at the same time there is something which weaves a thread through a lot of my working life which is loneliness and isolation. Um, I know a lot of people feel the same way, especially women, because they tell me about it through freelance feels. Um, I felt this keenly over my freelance career, from being at home and having nobody to talk to about a pitch or a worry that I'm having, to kind of talk about an ignored email, um, through to being on so-called shifts, um, kind of in-house work on magazines, perhaps, you know, not being part of the lunch outing, drinks or an in-joke. Um, I wonder if more women feel isolated and I certainly speak to more women than men for freelance feels about their ups and downs and in terms of them interacting with the site and Instagram feed, they're the ones who come to me and say thank you for speaking about all the things that we go through and particularly loneliness and isolation. Um, I actually think women are more likely to speak up and ask for help but the thing is we're encouraged to be strong and empowered and sometimes saying we feel lonely can be a contradiction to that calling to be strong and empowered as women. My advice for other women who are feeling isolated is to try and shift things bit by bit. Don't join a co-working space or go to 20 networking events in one month because you will be exhausted and it will have a negative impact on your mental health. Um, I would say instead try one event, perhaps in the next two weeks, and find a networking event that you think will have like-minded souls. Try and find your tribe at the event you go to. Um, join a Facebook group. I run a Facebook group for journalists and PRs called Freelance Media Women. There's also Freelance Heroes and the Being Freelance community, both of which I heartily recommend as places where you will find people to talk to, men and women, who are very attuned to the feelings of isolation that we all feel. Um, and you could join uh, a local meetup or try creating your own local meetup, perhaps for people who are in the same position. If you would like to join the Freelance Feels community, I'd love to see you there. It's at freelance underscore feels on Instagram and Twitter and www.freelancefeels.com.